What's up s'mores, I'm Shannon Morse. Welcome to my YouTube channel all about travel and technology. And today I'm so excited to share with you something that I don't usually see at CES. This is a single board computer and it is from ASUS. And I really wanted to share this with you because I'm excited about it. I love competition in this space and I think it's gonna be really interesting for hackers and developers and people who are working on startups and trying to create their own businesses using technology. Now, before I get to this thing that I totally just teased, I did want to mention I am at the Consumer Electronics Show, so make sure to subscribe if you are interested in seeing more content from the show floor. And also, I wanted to thank my sponsor, Lenovo. This episode is proudly sponsored by Lenovo. Lenovo is bringing smarter technology to all by envisioning a world where every person and business has access to the tech they need to achieve their goals. Lenovo is building on these ideals by developing world-changing technologies that create a more inclusive, trustworthy, and sustainable digital society. Their products are available in 180 different markets worldwide, and they are designing, engineering, and building the world's most complete portfolio of smart devices and infrastructure. By doing so, Lenovo is leading an intelligent transformation, creating better experiences and opportunities for millions of customers around the world. Check out everything Lenovo has to offer over at Lenovo.com and make sure to visit Lenovo.com CES to learn more about all of their products that they are introducing this week at CES 2020. And I wanna thank Lenovo again for sponsoring my episode. All right, let's go ahead and talk about the Tinker Edge R and T. And both of these are from ASUS, and both of them are very similar to the Tinker Boards, which have already been on the market for quite some time. Now, these products were introduced in November. However, I don't have pricing yet. Those aren't available yet. Uh, ASUS is dedicating some work to Internet of Things by creating these kind of boards. Uh, single board computers like the Tinker Board run on the ARM-based architecture, so they aren't necessarily like uh, Windows 10 computer, for example, they're more similar to a Raspberry Pi. But these can be used for things like a home theater PC, or a network configuration device, or a security device, or a monitoring device. But these new ones can be used for things like machine learning, image recognition, and object detection, which is very, very cool because it has this built in. The difference between the original Tinker boards and the Tinker Edge R&T are these are edge computing devices, so they do have that technology built in. Now they are slightly different as far as connectivity options and they will have slightly different price points, but both of them have onboard machine learning technology. The nice thing about these kind of boards is that you can do localized learning, localized education, localized development instead of working up in the cloud. So a product like this would be really great for somebody who is a freelancer or if you are just looking into like learning how to hack single board chips, single board computers. I think it's really cool, especially if you are a developer or if you are a hacker or if you just want to educate yourself on how these devices work. The nice thing about these boards, which are made by ASUS is that they have that hardware brand behind them. So they have a lot more durability and sustainability, and they also can last for a nice long time. They have really nice components, both of them do, and I will put a link down below for a description so that you can see all of the components yourself. I just think that they are really interesting devices, and I would love to know down below if you would use one of these and what kind of technology you would love to use on it. Now, both of these do have a community, there is a forum, there's a GitHub, so you can download all sorts of different distros for them. They work with Linux, of course, they work with their own operating system, and ASUS is really focused on developing more content for these kind of devices and helping bring them to market. So leave a comment below if you have any questions or if you wanna learn more about the Tinker Edge devices. I know I would, I would love to get one on the show. I think it would be really, really fun to hack with. Uh, so comment below, don't forget to subscribe subscribe and like this video, and I will have more from CES very shortly. My name is Shannon Morris. Thank you so much to my s'mores and Lenovo, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.